Hello everyone, how's it going? Dr. Incompetent here, and let's play some Core Keeper, shall we? Well, I've been having um, a good time getting back into this, and got a nice mining pick, and you know what I've decided is, well, I can shovel all this sand. It's actually, the sand makes for a better place to clear out. You know, it's easy. There's some sparklies. I kind of feel like, you know, just like you would in maybe oxygen not included or something, just to clear out all of the cavern. You know, I don't think there's any cave-ins possible, so as long as I can't get smashed, I might as well keep checking. Let's see what's here. Alright, we got some copper. There's some artifacts over there. Let's go explore that, but first of all, let me get this copper brewing. Yeah, put it in there. That's eight bars. That's actually a pretty good amount. And let's, um... You know what? I'm going to put some things away. I'm going to go ahead and put away, uh... This sand and these walls. The floor, uh, the turf wall, the fungal soil, the dirt wall... Looks good. What does this do? Grows into a spicy vegetable when planted. I don't know much about planting. I do have a hoe, but I don't know how to prepare the ground very well. Anyway, I guess I could do that. I'm going to craft a bunch of torches. I'm kind of, you know, running low, so let me get some more torches going. And we'll just put some here. I've said this before, but I'm really, I really dig the, the lighting effects in the game. It's really neat how you, know, you have this classic 16-bit kind of looking game in a cutaway isometric world, and yet um, you get these more modern day um, you know, light and shadows. It's just great. There's a ton of stuff here. I like to kind of just get the torches down first and then take inventory on what we found. There we go. So this is better. I feel like I can look around and I will come back here. And this is where the, uh, you know, the inner archaeologist comes into play, uh, which is, I'm going to get all this copper. There's bad guys coming, unfortunately, but... It's like, do I just break all of these pots? And is that even reasonable? I found iron ore and I found fiber. Uh, we found an ocarina, a crude bomb. And I answered my own question, yes. Even though these are beautiful and charming pots, uh, my solution appears to be just break them like Zelda to open them. I got a mechanical part. Now, can I break... No, I tried to mine the stone, but I'm not having any luck with that. I'm going to go back through here, go back to my base, and I'm going to just check. Yep, we got all these bars. Let's go ahead and just, um, interesting, I got gold. Yep, you can hold the right trigger and push A to just notch that right in there. And I'm going to actually, speaking of notching it in there, I'm going to take this out and see... First things first, I want to make a copper sword. This does 39 to 47 melee damage with 2.5 attacks per second. Um, whereas this is 25 to 29. So this is a ton more damage. And so we'll go ahead and get this. Um, I'm going to take some more of these bars as they get made. I'm going to go put away some older equipment. You know, I don't think I need to carry this around. Although, look at this. My copper pickaxe is about to break. So, I, I'll probably need to make another one of those before I make armor. Because I don't want to be without a copper pickaxe. But I've got my new sword. So, I feel pretty 
decent about that. Ouch. Well, okay. I say that, and then I got hit. Yeah, these guys are way easier. You can see I'm doing a ton more damage. And here's some more copper. Speak of the copper. Let me go ahead and then drop in a bunch of torches. Here's wood, mercifully. And I still haven't figured out. It's like you don't really, at least so far, I haven't really found an axe. Oh, this is, look, there's a X marks the spot. I'm going to dig that up with my shovel. Ooh, here's a bunch of copper. Very exciting to see something like this. And I want to dig, but... My shovel doesn't seem to work on that. Can I pickaxe it? No. Okay. Well, I guess I wanted that to be something, but it apparently is not. That was just my inner treasure hunter dreaming. Bad guy. Let him go ahead and do his thing. Okay. And I'm going to... I also, of course, like torches because it just helps me see where I've been. You were here. Ooh, sparkle. And it actually goes back to my base. I feel like I need all this wood. Sparkle. Ooh. Cool. I'm going to come in here, but first, let me just light this up a bit. Get my sword out. Oh, who's this guy? Uh, I don't know. I got a lively egg, whatever that means. Okay. Got that guy. Alright. Just put in some stuff. There's sparkles over there, but I need to go back. So I'm going to mine toward my base. I might not have enough pickaxe to get there. I don't think I will, actually. So I'm going to kind of skip this project. I will put a torch here just to commemorate the experience. But I'm going to run back. Alright, that guy's gone. Let me check my skills. No. No. Just just looking to see if I got a little point there. I didn't. I'll get over it. Alright. And we will knock in... All of that. Take out all of that. Alright. I need to make... Um, a copper pickaxe. And just put it here. Yeah, you know, maybe I wasn't digging right with my shovel. Maybe you need to do something else to, to do that. It's possible. Electronics table. Ooh. Well, that seems really interesting, too. All right. Um, what do I want to make? Do I want to make a shield? Yes. Oh, we got a new talent point in crafting. All right. So let me go to my equipment. I'm going to put this in my offhand. Okay, fantastic. And then we got a talent point in crafting. 
and the first point says six percent chance to gain an extra item when crafting any wall floor bridge or fence that's really good look at all this great that's 14 bars all right so uh, as much as i want armor let me just get myself um this does two by two tiles i'm gonna make a new shovel and make a new hoe all right put all this stuff away just for the time being and anything else that i have that i already have up here um i think there's a way to like quick yeah here we go quick stack perfect you know like this mechanical part and this ancient gemstone uh caveling bread interesting pet pellet things like that i'm gonna put that away now i need to make another chest i would imagine I'm kind of running out of it running out of storage um okay i'm gonna put in uh the heart berry i mean it sounds like good for cooking i don't need all of this food that i have though bomb is sweet musical instrument gold or hatchable is there a way to hatch it i don't know Uh, I'm going to put this food ration back. I've got these mushrooms, so I kind of just eat those for now. All right. Now we're done with copper. Let me put in this tin ore. And now I'm going to make um, copper. And we'll make a copper hat. Great. And I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff on oh I look good oh ooh, bucket helmet that's pretty funny let me go and drop in some of this old equipment tremendous all right now I feel like I can go out on the town I got a shield to block with it's new um, let me craft some more torches while I'm here. Just can't have enough of those. All right, I'm going to check out these X's now with my... Um... Yes, okay. You. The problem is you need to dig up with the left trigger. And you... Uh, right trigger like attacks. Okay, so we got... What did we get? We got a leaf fossil, it's valuable, and a bomb pepper seed again. All right, and there's these kind of blue glowy flowers that just seem like I want them. Uh, so I got tulip glow seeds and glow tulips by using the pickaxe on them. Wow, look at my reflection in the water. What a cool effect. All right, um... You just drop some torches in. Okay. Try to fish here, I guess. Did I see any sparkles? And would they show up on this map or not? That I don't know. You can zoom in. You can switch between, I guess you can like maybe put markers on the map or something. Oh, there's a maybe a fishing spot. It's like glowing. We 
We got some bomb peppers. Delicious. And break that open. Ear plate. Okay. Sure. Look, there's a sparkle right above me, and you can see it's not on the map. So, the answer is no. You're quite hungry. Okay. Well, what do we do about that? We eat. Alright. Now my pickaxe broke, but I immediately equipped my other pickaxe, which is cool. Love that when that happens in games. Right, I could dig through this sand just... Oh my god. Fine. Okay, I blocked that guy pretty reasonably. These guys are um, much less intimidating now with all the, you know, the armor and the hardware and stuff I have. I'm just going to drop some torches down. Now I want to build a little bridge, don't I? But I don't have any with me. So this is... I should have brought some bridge tiles with me. I don't think I can craft it on the go. I can't. So that was a mistake. So let me go home and, you know, craft some. Hey, new talent point available and running. All right. You love to see it. Running means... Um, now, I can't really get these yet. So it looks like you have to move all the way up. No problem. And then just better at mining. That's tremendous. All right, let's go ahead and take that out and put that in there. Try to make an iron bar. There it goes. Let me just kind of sort this and dump everything in there. Uh, this is a broken pickaxe, so I don't know how to... Oh, you need to build, like, a repair bench or something, don't you? Right. Well, I can build a bed, though. Because I have fiber. So let's definitely do that. Um, if I want to make... I need copper bars, which... Oh, right, I gotta actually make the copper. Let's go place our bed. I'll put this seed in here, this up here, um, the ear plate, the bomb pepper, I guess, the broken item, the leaf fossil. I'll put that there, pretend like I'm going to use stuff, and then let me put this up here, switch to this bed, and uh, we can rotate it with A. Just kind of put a bed, like, right there. Looks great. Very good-looking game. I'm sleeping. Oh, and you can restore your health this way. That's tremendous. I'm underground, so there's no real way to tell night and day. But that's okay. I mean, why would there be? I actually saw a documentary. or No, it wasn't a documentary. It was just a news article about these... Pe uh, it was a French science team, maybe. And they spent, like, some record number of days living underground... And that was definitely one of the things that they said was the the hardest about it was like, you just didn't know what time it was. And if it was night or day and how like you couldn't tell how much time had passed, not necessarily that you didn't know like exactly, oh, it's 4.15 p.m., but just like, how long have I been here? All right, can I, I broke that. And I feel kind of bad about it. Should I? My mining damage is too low. Okay. It's like, should I have done that? I don't know. I did it. Magic releases. I got some floor tiles. Dark cabling. 
Doesn't sound good. I got an Oracle card called Brilliance. I mean, there's so many items in this game. I'm just like, what is going on here? Okay. Um, a charred card with golden borders and image of a glow tulip looks like it's part of a set. Good. We got iron ore. Okay. Scrap parts. That's good stuff. I'm going to go ahead and just smack stuff. Boy, there's a bunch, and I mean a bunch of mushrooms here. I'm here for the lumber. Thank goodness for these roots. Look, buddy. Ooh, plus one vitality. We will take it. By the way, any treasure? We're in. There's some sparklies. I'm in. Hey, look at this. Speaking of a garden, it looks like somebody has like a whole mushroom garden out here. I'm excited to... Ooh, sparkle heaven. Interesting. All right. I'm going to check out this garden. What is this? I got a bunch of torches out because I like torches. All right. So there's a meanie and then somebody was just living here look at this there's a house and a secret treasure we got an iron key well that seems important oh it's a chair i was like what am i doing i'm trying to sit on a chair how about that all right i got a bomb i got a stool I got a wash basin. I'll take all this stuff. Whatever you got. Oh my goodness. We are hitting the mother load. That is a lot of metal. I feel great about that. Uh oh. It's going to blow up. At first, I wasn't sure what was happening, and luckily, at the very last moment, my instinct kicked in, and I ran away. Brave Sir Robin. All right, let's get these wooden fences. Man, my inventory has got to be, yeah, just about full. I'm going to start growing my own mushrooms if I can, though. have to see about how that works there's some walls here too I mean it's probably unnecessary to break this guy's entire house but or gals I don't know who was here I'll take these floor tiles I'll take everything yeah, you can dig up the tiles. Might as well. Oh, my inventory. It's full. Okay, what do I want to trash? Iron key. It's a key item. All right, well, that's good. Um, gee. I don't like trashing anything, but I'll tell you what it is. It's going to be... um. Yeah, something like sand wall. You know, we can probably just get rid of that. But it's definitely time to go. Like, if I'm having trouble carrying stuff, we should go home. Okay. We're back. So let's just go here right away and uh, dump everything that we can in there. That's tremendous.
And looks like all of our copper is done. I'll take this out. And I'll make 21 more. I need it all. Like items can go in here. And then this is a huge bomb. I'll put this here and this. Fiber. Nah, craft some of the basic crafting stuff I'm gonna keep on me, but and then this, I'm gonna put all this furniture down. It's good for filling up watering cans. See, that's great. Who doesn't want that? Um I'm gonna maybe I can see if it's possible for me to make a garden. First of all, let's eat. And then, let me put this watering thing. We can just put it right here. Just in case anybody needs it. We can put a little stool, you know, down there if you want to sit. And then, let's see. Well, yeah, let's get my full set. Like that. Wooden bow seems awesome. Okay. Let me see. Where do I equip the bow? Is it in like equipment two? Or. Oh no, it'd be just be like a weapon you switch to. I don't, I don't know if I have arrows though, but okay. There you go. Got it all on. Looking real good. All right. Now let's make some new crafting stations. So the glass smelter. All right, sure. We'll just kind of work on these bit by bit. Glass smelter goes there. And it turns in... You could smelt what? Sand? I'm guessing. Do I have any sand wall though? Anyway. Let me go down here. I'm just going to clear out some space and try to make a little garden. Ooh. There's grass. I don't know. I'll make, I can make a good amount of space. Guess I could just use bombs, but I don't know how to craft them, so... We'll go ahead and, you know. Put some light around. Okay. Let me see about this hoe. Wow. Yeah, that's a huge garden. All right. Looks amazing. Now let's see about seeds. I mean, can I just grow mushrooms in here? No, these are like you eat it. This is not like I plant it. So then I can go here, though, and I can just take out all of my seeds. Here, um, sort these. Bomb pepper. All right. Let me put this old stuff back. Let me check over here in this chest. Bomb pepper seed. Heartberry seed. Root seed. I mean, root seeds are actually good for, you know, the purposes of roots. Actually, let me try this sand. Does this make glass if I put it in there? It does. Since nothing takes fuel, it's like, why not just constantly have it going? All right. And then now we can make some new crafting stations. I can make the railway forge. Um, the carpenter's table. The electronics table. Egg incubator. This is how I can hatch the eggs. Okay, well, I just need glass. Can't I? Didn't I see like a repair thing? Maybe I imagined that there was a... Oh, here it is. A watering can. So I can water. Well, we definitely have to have that. And then here's the salvage. 
The cooking pot. Oh, okay. Feeding tray. Yeah, I don't have a lot of this stuff. I'll build this. I'll build that. All right, now that's everything on that screen. And let's go ahead and build an electronics table, I guess. I don't know. Build everything. All right, let me go into my inventory and just kind of put up some different seeds for now. Uh-huh. Okay. I'll try to dig some soil. I don't know if it matters what kind of soil you plant stuff in. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and put these here. And this can go here. Fantastic. And then let me put all these crafting stations up here as well. All right, so this is a new one. Just kind of put it there. Put that there. And the cooking. And then put it down here. There. Well, I don't know any recipes, though. Oh. Electricity generator. Wow. Wow. All right. Uh, repair tools. Okay, great. Oh, reinforce. What does it take to reinforce? Copper bars. Okay. That's cool. And let me go ahead and put my watering can up here then, I guess. And I can fill it up in, in this. I'm watering my crops. Stardew Valley style. All right. There they go. Oh, maybe you get, like, unlimited arrows with this bow. That seems nice. All right, how you doing? You finished all this? Okay, great. Perfect. And what is this? Oh, it's making all the glass. Great. So now we can make, um, well, we need more copper for the egg incubator, but we're getting there. So look at this. We have, like, a garden. Tons of... Um, different crafting stations I'll eat that we've built. And if I look at the map, I mean, well, let me zoom out. Oh, God, you can zoom out that far? Ridiculous. <laughs> this is phenomenal. What a cool game. There's. It seems like there's already so much to it, and yet, you know, um, there could be a ton more as they keep adding to the game it's still you know early access oh you know what let me check my skills really fast no no new points we tried i gotta figure out how to get seeds for the mushrooms i get mushrooms to eat but not seeds very easily let me put some torches down. There we go. Place is looking good. I'm going to hop in the old slammer. Can't sleep when enemies are nearby. Really? But I don't see any enemies. You tell me where they are, and I'll fight them. That's a shame. Maybe they're down here. Oh, and... We also need to do what I originally set out to do, which is make enough bridges um, so that I can be sure to travel. 
easily. You know what? I should put down these fences around my garden. We don't want people trampling. There's no reason at all to do this, by the way. I'm just actually probably making my life harder. Um, but it looks good. Is that, you know, does that trump everything here? The, the fact that it looks good? finish with this fence you can see my crops they're trying to thrive how could I give them anything less than the best this makes it so I can't really get down there too easily but that's okay there yeah it's sort of fenced in I mean why not I'm going to dig this around just to kind of... There's my alternative route. Amazing. All right, everybody. Well, this is a good place to end this episode. We are doing beautifully here. Just kind of knocking stuff out and seeing um, all the things that we can build and expanding. Got new armor. Leveling up. Got a watering can full-on garden thanks so much for watching take care